have an expansion to unbox here for the Mansions of Madness board game themed in the Cthulhu Arkham Horror Universe. This is one of their print-on-demand expansions. You can still buy it in the store, but they uh, sell it directly out of their website too. This does require the Mansions of Madness base game and the larger box Forbidden Alchemy expansion to play, so you have to have both of those things to use this. For those that sleeve, it does take the one green and one yellow of the Fantasy Flight style sleeve or something that would be similarly appropriate. So you get the pieces here. You have the intro piece and then you're going to have the keeper setup card. You're going to have the special rules for the game which includes a list of the contents. You're going to have the prologue story to read. You have the a story so far on the back also. I'm not sure how much those if one leads into the other. Seems like you'd be able to read that one first. It's the outside of the packaging. And then you have the setup map for the investigators. You're going to get two things of cards here. You have uh, the larger cards. And you have the five event cards here. And there are two, three, two, three. First, second, third, fourth, and fifth. And they're going to come out as the uh, story progresses. You have some new keeper action cards. So you have a strange energies card. A from beyond card. And another world card. Those are double sided. And then the last large card you have is going to be an objective card. And it has uh, the objective on one side and then the laboratory prologue on the back side. And you have your small cards here. So we're going to have You're going to have the exploration cards, which all have the this backing to them. And then all the things that go along with that, you have the story based cards that you're going to find. You have some whiskey, unstable rib, notes, different things to be discovered along as you go on the adventure. Some of them are useful items, some of them progress the story. You're going to have four lock cards in here. And then the uh, explanation of the things behind those, which you'll use to unlock them. You have seven portal cards here. And it looks like they go to seven different other world locations here. And they have some different actions and what you have to do to close the portal. What happens if you fail to close the portal. And then the last thing we're gonna have here is obstacle cards. So we have uh, the machine, disturbing the veil, secret safe, and dangerous chemicals. So three of those look like they're have you solve puzzles. And the other one looks like it's just test base. So, not a whole lot in these expansions, just enough to where you can uh, play a new story and continue to make use of the Matches of Madness game after you've already maybe played the other stories a few times or uh, 
you've played through them once and you really don't feel like playing them again. It adds a little, a little more uh, life to the game. But that is the laboratory expansion for Mansions of Madness. It does require the base game and the Forbidden Alchemy expansion.